A mudra is a sacred and symbolic gesture found in yoga, Buddhism, Hinduism, and Jainism. Across various religious and spiritual traditions, there are believed to be around 400 known mudras. The term mudra translates from Sanskrit as gesture, mark, or seal. The purpose of the hand gestures can vary according to tradition. Each mudra is a technique to give clear messages to the body's energy system. Here are some of my favorite mudras. The Gyan Mudra is one of the most popular mudras. It is formed by touching the tip of the index to the tip of the thumb. It stimulates the knowledge and wisdom within you. Its effect is receptivity, balance and gentle expansion. The Shuni Mudra is formed by touching the tip of the middle finger to the tip of your thumb. It helps to encourage compassion, understanding and patience towards others. Shuni Mudra helps negative emotions turn into positive ones. The Surya Mudra is formed by touching the ring finger with your thumb. Surya means sun, and just like the sun, this mudra provides heat and energy. It increases the fire element in the body. The Buddhi Mudra is performed by touching the tip of the little finger with your thumb. It is meant to improve mental clarity and balance the water element within the body. It can also help relieve muscular pain. This mudra has many names. The Anjali Mudra is also known as Pranam Mudra, Namaste Mudra, Prayer Mudra, Atmanjali Mudra, and Namaska Mudra. Pressing the two palms in front of the chest is an everyday greeting in India, a gesture of prayer in many spiritual traditions and a symbol of gratitude in yoga and beyond. This mudra neutralizes the two part of your body, the right, positive, masculine side and the left, negative, feminine side. It can also calm the mind and increase awareness. For women, the Venus Luck is performed by interlacing your fingers with the left thumb on top. For men, it's the same but with your right thumb on top. The Venus Luck Mudra represents 
sensuality and can help you concentrate better. There are many mudras to choose from when practicing. Make sure you're doing them right and do your own research if you're uncertain. Thank you for watching this video. I hoped it helped you. Satnam.